the Wright brothers have a significant place in the history of aviation technology. Everyone knows that they invented the real airplane, but few people know about their other contributions. They patented and monopolized some of the airplane technologies, which greatly hindered the development of airplane technology for a while. However, this did not stop other designers. Many innovative designs were proposed, which had a huge impact on future generations, such as ailerons and flaps, which are still in use today. To avoid the patents, there was another type of airplane design at the time, known as the circular wing aircraft. Compared to the Wright brothers' straight wings, the circular wing design featured a large circular wing enclosing the fuselage in the middle, resulting in a smaller wingspan but a larger wing area. American designer Chance Vaught greatly admired the circular wing aircraft. He believed that a larger wing area would improve the aircraft's performance. He is also considered the founder of the circular wing aircraft. In 1911, Chance Vaught turned his idea into reality and designed a unique aircraft, which was nicknamed the Umbrella Plane due to its shape. The Umbrella Plane had a very rudimentary structure, appearing thinner compared to other designs of the same period. The aircraft was mainly constructed using wood and fabric, with a simple framework for the fuselage to support the engine, landing gear, and other equipment. The landing gear had a dual structure with wheels and skids, and the pilot rode on the fuselage to operate the aircraft. The engine drove a wooden propeller through a transmission shaft at the front. Nine wooden beams radiated outward from the fuselage as the center of the aircraft, connected by fabric in between, providing stability. Additionally, a large amount of wire was used. This fabric formed the aircraft's wings, which appeared as a nonagon when viewed from above, with a small vertical tail at the rear. Most people would believe that this unique aircraft would not be able to take off. In fact, it never achieved a true flight, but there are photos showing the limited liftoff from the ground. Although Chance Vought dedicated himself to the development of circular wing aircraft, this structure has not become mainstream. Only a few experimental models were produced, and Chance Vought did not live to see a perfect flight. He passed away in 1930 at the age of 42 due to sepsis. However, he still had a significant influence in the aviation industry. Many aircraft were named after him, and the aircraft company he co-founded with Birdseye Lewis was the second aircraft manufacturing company in the United States. A few years after his death, the United States launched a circular wing aircraft called the Sun Umbrella, followed by the more famous Flying Pancake, which can be considered as the successful development of circular wing aircraft.